Good morning guys. I am starting the morning with an early coffee date. It is 7.17 so I'm going to be late and I'm going to meet one of my besties, Tara, for a coffee to catch up in a local coffee shop. Just have a little moment of catching up and just putting the world to right. I've got myself ready for the day because I thought by the time I've had a coffee and caught up I would want to get quite a lot done before I head out later. So glammed up for an early coffee day. Lucky girl. But yeah, let's go get some coffee. I am wearing just my new Pegia Uggs, which I just love. The cream trousers are from River Island. Uniqlo t-shirt, mango coat, and my brown Pelene bag. So I am back from my little coffee date with Tara. Oh my god, that was just so precious. Just love her so much and just so blessed that she's like one of my close friends. I am now making porridge with pear and I've just opened a new almond butter. I am so excited for this one. This is the Pip and Nut Chocolate Orange Almond Butter. I feel like I'm gonna have to do a taste test before I put it in because I feel like this is just going to be so delicious. I'm just like mixing it all together because the oil has separated. Oh my god, that is the best thing I've ever put in my mouth. Wow, that is incredible. It literally tastes like chocolate orange. <gasps> mm, stunning. And that is my breakfast. Some gluten-free oats, pear, the chocolate almond butter, which I'm so excited to delve into and probably gonna eat the whole jar in one week and a sprinkle of ginger. I'm just getting myself ready as I am on my way to a really lovely Joe Malone event and we are going ice skating. It is at Battersea power station i believe it is now open to the public but i think today is a bit of a press launch day and i'm just getting myself ready and i've gone for quite a i'd say joe malone attire i'm going for the all black and cream look and i've got the most cutest little bow in my hair which i think will be really pretty i'm also wearing these really lovely monica veneda little studs and i just think they're so beautiful and vintage i've got a bow in so i feel like that does all the talking i want to keep it quite minimal fragrance of the day is not joe malone i don't actually have any joe malone fragrances at the moment one of my favorite ones is myrrh and tonka i'm actually in sloan square in a minute so maybe i will go and show some of my favorite fragrances however i do think there's going to be a quite nice array of fragrances when we get there because we're going to have a, like a little celebration before we get on the ice so my current favorite fragrance at the moment is the joe loves amber lime and bergamot and honestly it is just beautiful it's like a really nice citrusy smoky scent it's so delightful so i'm wearing my jumper from and other stories i just really love the fit and i've just rolled it down for now just so i don't get any makeup on the bow is actually from amazon i will leave that down below as well it's not the best quality but it does the job it was only five pounds um, shorts are just old River Island and they're just the perfect length to just feel like I'm wearing like a little dress. That's the attire I wanted to go for. I'm going to pair it with my knee-high boots. Actually, I need to put some socks on as we are going ice skating. So my little toes need an extra layer because I feel like you always have to when you go ice skating. I'm so excited to go ice skating. This is going to be so precious. I'm just pairing it with my Zara boots. I'm meeting Holly in Sloan Square first as we're going to shoot the outfits we're wearing and then Bradley's going to pick us up and then I'm going to pair it with my black and other stories coat because it's a really nice crop coat and I think this just looks really really sweet and very chic. I think I'm going to wear my Celine sunglasses. Let me go and get those. How ridiculously cute does this look? <laughs> I feel so chic. And then I'm going to pair it with my black Pelene bag because it's just such a classic. If you are on the hunt for a present, a designer bag for Christmas, I would really recommend Pelene. They are just so beautiful. I actually do have one I want to unbox with you soon. Um, it's just arrived and hint, it's in my favorite color at the moment. So loving that. But yeah, especially as I'm going for like an all black look, I feel like this coat is the perfect attire. Really happy with this look i think it looks very sweet i'm going to take my, my celine sunnies like i said and yeah lipstick of choice lipstick is
is of course the Bobbi Brown Slow Jam because this colour is just my favourite at the moment. And that is me done. Jo Malone ice skating outfit for this afternoon. I think this is very lovely. I will leave everything down below and if it's sold out I'll leave some similar as well. I feel like this is the start of all the Christmas activities and festivities and I'm so here for it. I have one partner in crime with me. Hello, hello. Hello, hello. We've just done some shooting, shot a couple of outfits. It has suddenly just dropped. It's so cold. And I'm full of a cold now. Yeah, unfortunately our friend Caroline, <laughs> Caroline if you're watching this, has made us very <laughs> poorly. Not very poorly, but I am. I'll be dramatic. Yeah. I am. Yeah. Poorly. Not feeling good. <laughs> yeah, we are now on to our next Portugal, which Hi, is honey. ice skating. My other partner in crime's here. So, Christmas has arrived at Battersea Power Station. I might up the sweets in there. <laughs> look at those. Oh, look at the flumps. Oh, oh my God, they're my favorite. work i had the loveliest afternoon with joe malone at battersea power station ice skating it was like the perfect way to start the christmas festivities i had so much fun and it was just uh, my heart is just so full of joy it's, that was just such a lovely way to kick it off also i just wanted to say that the ice skating rink at battersea power station is now open to the public by the time you were watching this so definitely book it in battersea power station is incredible and what they've done with the place is just amazing. It is the perfect place to go Christmas shopping and to celebrate the festivities with the ice skating rinks. It's got some really lovely pre skiing wine bar kind of vibes and it's just a really lovely festive thing to do. It was really fun. I had so much fun. I didn't really film that many clips as I was a bit too scared to bring my camera on to the ice. So I did a couple of clips on my phone and some photos so I will leave them in. But I kindly went away with a really lovely goodie and it's come at the perfect time because I'm gonna set up a very chilled lovely evening right now so I kindly received from Jo Malone a really lovely parcel of goodies I kindly received the Jo Malone ginger ginger biscuit scented candle and cologne it honestly smells incredible I got to smell some of the candles earlier at the event and they were just delightful so I feel like I have a really lovely evening set up as I'm going to pour myself a bath I'm feeling a little bit run down and I feel like what I'm about to show you has come at the perfect time to create a really lovely wind down evening so this part of the vlog is very kindly sponsored by Tropic Skincare Tropic Skincare is an award-winning vegan beauty brand from beauty products to skincare you name it they do it just very very well and it's a brand that I have held close to my heart for a very long time actually I feel like this is a little bit of a full circle because I actually receive a couple of tropic skincare products from my friends and family at Christmas and I just love them so the fact that I get to work with them this year is very very wonderful so if you are wanting to treat yourself or your loved ones here are a couple of gift ideas that I thought I would share with you so I'm gonna start off with the larger gift sets so they have a few aromatherapy collection gift sets they're designed to inspire you with different moods so for instance you have this one which is the gift of joy and you have this one which is the gift of 
of peace. Now I think we know which one I'm gonna pick. Drift into a deeply restorative sleep with their peaceful aromatherapy collection. I think that's what I need. So I'm gonna unbox this one with you because I don't want to do too many. What I love as well, it comes in a really lovely gift set as well. So I think these are really aesthetically pleasing and really pretty and I just think it's such a lovely way to gift someone. And I feel like as well, when it comes to pampering products, you just cannot go wrong. So whether that be skincare, some PLC products like what I'm about to show you, I just feel like if you don't know what to get your loved ones, you just cannot go wrong. Like, I promise you, this is what to get them. So this is how the gift of peace looks like. It comes in a really nice parcel. So in this, you receive the So Sleepy Temple Roll-On. I have this by the side of my bed. Just roll it on your pulse points. And inhaling that just honestly, instantly relaxes you. These products always smell like I've been to a spa. They are just so beautiful. The Magnesium Body Butter Cream with Wild Lavender and Mineral Magnesium. And if you don't know about magnesium, magnesium is an incredible ingredient which is going to really help relax your whole body and let you unwind. I always add a lot of magnesium into my evening routine. I am such a big advocate for magnesium. I have it in tablet forms. I have it in a powder form which is like this lemon raspberry drink that I have in the evenings and that really helps my body just relax and wind down. So this, oh my god, I'm so excited to put this on. This is the So Sleepy Magnesium Body Buttercream. This is incredible. So what I usually do, and I am, I can be quite lazy when it comes to the evening. So what I actually do is leave this by my bedside table and I just put it on my arms, put it on my legs, hands and feet, and oh, honestly, it is just so relaxing. And then, last but not least, you have the pillow mist, which is honestly, it is incredible. I spray this over my pillow, go and get myself ready for bed, and I come back and it, my bedroom just smells so wonderful and so zen. And then I do my rituals with the oils and the creams. I think this is such a lovely gift set. I then wanted to share these ones with you as I think these are really lovely stocking fillers or if you have a loved one you want to just give them a little gift, I think you just definitely again cannot go wrong with. So we have the Beauty Bauble which is a skin hydrating gift collection. If you've got any work colleagues or perhaps you want to gift one of your beauticians or your hairdressers, I think this is a really lovely gift and actually a really nice way to introduce someone to Tropic skincare. So it comes in a little parcel like this. I mean, isn't that just the cutest? And it has these really gorgeous travel size products. So we have the deep hydration mask, soothing moisturizer. Oh, these are gonna be incredible. We have a nutrient boost oil and a hydrating oil as well. So this is just a really lovely travel collection as well as a really lovely gift, like I said, to introduce someone to. This is the Tropical Showers collection in the form of a beauty cracker. And I just think that's just such a lovely gift. I think that's so beautiful. Maybe paired with a bottle of bubbles. I think that would be just the perfect gift. So I think throughout the vlogs I am going to be sharing with you some of my favourite gift ideas and I just think again like I said you cannot go wrong with gifting someone some really lovely skincare, some really lovely pampering products and Tropic skincare are so beautiful and like I said I have adored them for quite a while so please take my word these are such beautiful gifts. I think they have a variety for everybody from loved ones to friends to colleagues or your beauticians like I said. So I will leave everything down below because I think they have the most beautifulest little gift sets. And thank you very much for Tropic Skincare for kindly sponsoring this video. <laughs> I am out of the bath and that was just sensational. That was very much needed. I've just been on the phone to my mum and I've actually just been moisturising with the magnesium body butter. This is beautiful. It's so lovely. This towel is bigger than me. But there is definitely nothing better than having a bath or a shower, fresh pyjamas, doing your skincare and just having like a proper ritual every night to really put you in the mood for sleep. If you work from home, you'll probably feel the same. I really struggle with actually switching off at night time, especially living on my own. I find it actually quite hard to 
stop so I carry on because I'm like there's no one here so I need to just carry on and sometimes I don't mind because there is quite a lot of work for me to do in my little one man band however yeah I find it really hard sometimes to switch off so I really want to make a thing of having a bit more of a ritual so if I have days where I am working from home to make sure that like around 5 30 when, when it's like the finishing work time to go for a walk and then come home bath or shower put some creams on and moisturizer and just feel really prepped for bed um i think that's a really lovely idea and i think that really set me up for a really nice wind down wind down before going to bed and i always find that when i have a bath or shower before bed i pass out straight away this is beautiful so i've lathered myself in this and like i said even just on your hands or your chest so beautiful and then i'm going to set myself up with prepping my pillows with some mist if that doesn't knock me out <laughs> i don't know what will so i'm gonna leave this down below with any more information so definitely check this out this is the so sleepy collection um this is the gift of peace thoroughly enjoyed it this evening so very ready for a lovely good night's sleep hey guys it is the next day now and feeling a lot better than yesterday i was feeling so under the weather it was ridiculous but i've had a really productive day i have had a really lovely morning with one of the pr girls uh, we went to the ivy for breakfast that was delicious and then i came home and did some work now i'm heading back into central um a few hours later and i'm actually going to go and see the gel bottle team as they have launched a, a pre collection which is so exciting so lots of glitter lots of glam lots of party nail inspo coming your way i'm very excited and by the looks of things on social media it's going to look very cute and festive and i think there's going to be some little fun festive activities going on as well so that would be really lovely so i thought i'd take you with me i have had my hair slicked back today because i thought it was gonna rain it might still rain um, and i just thought there was no point doing my hair so i've made a bit of a statement with these gorgeous earrings from saru these are their new collection and they are just incredible and just so vintage i adore wearing my marcella london jacket which i love and i've actually got two thermal long sleeve tops underneath because it is chilly jeans and then boots i was in my mules but i think i need a little bit more warmth but anyway i'm about to head out the door so let's go and get some nails done <music> I was saying to my friends and I feel like this is like you can put this into anything in life I always said to my friend Tara and she said this yesterday and she always now swears by it as well when it comes to maybe like Socializing or stepping out of your comfort zone or doing something at work or you know I always say it's kind of like going to the gym and doing a workout you you don't want to go you don't fancy it But when you get there and you do it you always feel so glad that you did you always feel better and you feel really good I literally had to preach to myself yesterday because I was so tired. I literally got back from getting my nails done, which are very cute, by the way. Very, very pretty. I'm not too sure. I'm going to have a little bit of an OCD moment with them. However, they'll do for now um, because I haven't had time to go to get my nails done from my friend Beth, which is so sad because I miss, I miss her for 
a one. These are incredible, but you know when you have you're you're loyal to your nail lady. And yeah, and I was I was just really not feeling it. I was feeling a little bit run down, but I literally came home, like put on my little pajamas, my little feather pajamas, turned around and went out the house. And I'm so glad I did. I had so much fun. We danced, we boogied, we put the Christmas tree up, we had some snacks. It was just the loveliest evening and i was so happy we did do that so my heart is full my heart is so full and my head is full of hangover and my body is full of lots of red wine <laughs> but i wouldn't want to be any other way but anyway i am now heading out the door it is half six i'm crazy and i'm going to do a gym session because i haven't been to the gym in ages it's just been super manic and then i'm actually off to king's road for a facial which is delightful so let's go and depuff and detox and get back on a health track i mean it's all about balance isn't it oh it's suddenly dropped it is freezing outside wonderful my skin is proper glowing i will leave this down below it's the most loveliest and i think my favorite place to come and get a facial it is just heaven i don't want to leave <laughs> i'm so cozy and i'm now filming some campaigns and christmas content and i am starving and my mouth is like watering because i am making pancakes and ugh I am very excited. I'm working with Garden of Life, which if you've followed me for a while, you know I'm a massive fan of. I'm showing the products that I use in my day-to-day -day life. So right now, I'm making some protein pancakes on the weekend. Lovely. So I received a really incredible delivery from The White Company, and they are these gorgeous bowls. I'm gonna show you the unboxing later. I've been planning to use it for a tablescape later on. But I have a couple of these, and I'm so obsessed, so I've started using them, which is very exciting. Actually having to use my ring light for um, filming, and it's actually became so handy, and it makes the quality of your phone look so good. So I have made my pancakes delightful. That was a mission. I feel like I'll get used to it, the hang of it. I really want to start filming more cooking stuff on Instagram. Um, it's just getting the knack of like filming it. But we have the protein pancakes. These are banana, egg, um, protein powder. This is the raw organic plant-based protein powder by Garden of Life. It is, there's no added sugars, it's gluten-free, it's unflavored, there's no stevia in it. It's also prebiotics and probiotics, which is amazing. Um, I've added cinnamon in there as well, of course. And then I've just put on top some raspberries and this almond chocolate butter, which I think I'm gonna have to have another serving of because this is stunning. But yeah, I'm really good. I'm very happy with those. Hello guys, it is a little later now and I'm coming to you on the floor, all zhuzhed up and glammed. I've washed my hair, I've done the whole shebang. I feel like a woman again. Um, I had a very productive, very good morning. I went to the gym, which was really lovely. It was a kettlebell weight class, which was really good. And then I walked to Pavilion Road in Sloan Square, which is, it's such a beautiful road. It's perhaps one of my favorite. Um, if you haven't been there before, it's just behind Peter Jones um, in Sloan Square. And it's a really lovely cobbled street. It's got some really lovely restaurants down there and some shops. So I'd really definitely check it out. And they're starting to get a little bit festive. And down there is Sarah Chapman and this is their flag store and it's such a beautiful one and it has the store at the bottom which has some mini facial treatment areas but also upstairs is a beautiful a bit more expanded not a spa like a treatment floor i would say it's like the treatment floor and i firstly met up with the lovely pr who who looks after sarah chapman because she is such a sweetheart we went for a really lovely coffee at granger co which is also down there um, down pavilion road and then i went off for a facial at sarah chapman and i had a bespoke led facial which is 60 minutes of just pure heaven for the skin i feel like my skin is just 
glowing it's just such an incredible treatment it's just got a mixture of detoxing hydrating led mask which is just phenomenal i do have an led mask at home which i just adore but to go in for a proper treatment to have my face really cleansed and she also got rid of loads of blackheads which is like my favorite thing i was like i bet this is like one of your favorite parts of the job and i got like a really lovely steam mask she did also lymphatic drainage which i didn't realize really helps with congestion so if you do suffer with quite a lot of congestion lymphatic drainage is actually quite a key treatment to have to help with kind of like clearing up those areas so that was amazing and then i had a 20 minute led mask which oh Honestly, I love an LED mask and I think that is what I've seen such a difference in with my skin. I have one at home which I adore and I try and use that three to four times a week. But the one at Sarah Chapman is phenomenal. So you can actually either go for an hour bespoke um, LED facial or the, they do the mini facials like I said downstairs and one of them involves the LED mask. I will leave it all down below if you want to check it out. I think it's actually a really lovely idea to gift someone maybe a voucher for Sarah Chapman to go and get a facial. I think I would be very very happy to receive a voucher for a facial because they are just the best and they're something we don't really treat ourselves much to and if you are in London and looking for a really lovely facial I would really really recommend Sarah Chapman. I actually went to m and quickly to get a new washing liquid. I know this is super random, but I love things like this. I don't have an m and near me. So I really made the effort to go and go and explore m and whilst I was down King's Road because ages ago I heard on TikTok people raving about the washing liquids and they were out of stock for so long. Um, so I went in and picked up a couple of like home cleaning products and they're really affordable and I picked up this one. It is sandalwood and bergamot. Wow, it smells beautiful. So I'm really excited to give this a go. They had some amazing products in there, so I want to go back for sure. I wasn't too sure if I could carry it all home. And then I picked up a white tea and rose washing up liquid. And I just thought that's so lovely and such a good idea because then when you're washing up, you're just filling your house with some really lovely fragrances. So yeah, I thought I'd quickly just give a little show and tell of that but yeah my skin is just feeling super super wonderful and just super glowy so i'll leave all of that down below and a massive thank you to sarah chapman for very kindly treating me to a lovely facial on a friday but anyway i'm gonna quickly do some work before heading over to my darling friend our letters see her new home i haven't been there since it was like halfway done very excited to see it and just have a really lovely wholesome evening with my best friend so we've arrived at our letters beautiful humble about got some olives and it's looking so cute look at the little pisco sour salt stunning i'm just gonna make us a lovely dinner gorgeous from your mom they're from my mom they're not opened oh my god stop i'm not taking them no 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 take it can we eat one? Oh my gosh we have to some sass i'm not filming your face don't worry <laughs> this is this is literally i the last time i we vlogged we were talking about pickles yeah, we got pickles. Yeah. This is gold. Oh my this god. Is... And her mum made them. They're huge. Oh my god, can we have one? Yeah, yeah absolutely. Right, let me try like this at a party. Wow. In Poland, we do this, so I'm going to do it. Jess like, is like, just way. give me the whole damn thing. <laughs> you know, some girls have like Prosecco and. <laughs> <laughs> We Not have in a Polish house, Amelia. Not, Not in a Polish, in a Polish house. house. <laughs> We've got homemade pickles. Right. Where do you get one? How hungry are you? Starving. Cheers, guys. Cheers. Chin, chin, chin. Mel zdrowie. Mmm. Wow. They're so different, aren't they? Like to. <laughs> Fizzy. Yeah. Mm. Well, because it's natural fermentation, isn't it? Little chef. Oh, we're not